I am because we are, we are because I am. So again, this uh, intrinsic bond between the individual and the community, that it's not just about economics, it's not just about producing Mercedes Benz and exporting them and earning a lot of money towards GDP. It's not just about improving my lifestyle, you know, moving from lower class to middle class. It's about helping the community move together. I would say that uh, most of our development is just on paper. Zambia is uh, progressing, its, it's GDP is, is, is what and what, but uh, we don't normally see that interpreting into uh, real situations for people who are on the ground. A hungry man, definitely, is an angry man, as they say. So it's easier for me to go get an, a, a hungry man who is angry, give him a stone and give him money, say, go and throw the stones there because he knows at the end of the day he wants to eat. Where are the poor? The poor are in the community. The church is a mouth, mouthpiece of the society. The kind of development approach that was there was more of these people are poor, let's try to help them. It was whole of handout thing and that created dependence. That is not a sustainable way even for themselves. It doesn't actually even promote dignity. They've got to do something for themselves. They've got to show that they had work. They want to do something. And this, this awareness now that we're trying to bring to them has really changed the way people look at themselves. Faith has to go with works, so it's not good enough to you know, pray, but you have to also pay attention to what's happening to your neighbor. This love of God and love of neighbor comes together. Uh, and I think our work is simply that, translating this scripture or gospel teaching of love of God and love of neighbor.